Teenagers dancing back to back at a prom goes viral as people criticize the obnoxious levels of coronavirus restrictions, but not everything is as it seems. From Rich Huey Studios in Hollywood, it is Andy to tell you everything about weird ballroom crazes that are happening, especially during COVID times, that make you wonder. But obviously, like and subscribe. Really do subscribe before you get this video because we want to see you coming back for more videos. But let's talk about this one. On October 10th, a Twitter user posted the now viral video. The 28 second long clip shows a big number of teenage couples facing away from each other and while interlocking their arms together behind them. Dancing. Wait, let me correct myself. Struggling to dance to ballroom music. Typical. The caption of the original post read, I can't make up my mind whether this is crazy or desperately sad. This is a prom dance in the age of global COVID scam. Society has entered self-destruction mode. And just to let you know, people were really fast to hop on that bandwagon of judgment for really investigating what was going on in the clip. A number of YouTube channels, publications, and celebrities shared it through their platforms. Twitter users in particular seemed to criticize the clip for its extreme COVID-19 safety measurements. Little did they know the actual intent behind the dance. Turns out it was all a gag done by a Czech dance school used for kids who enrolled in their ballroom courses. They managed to pull a joke not only on their entire classmates, but the whole internet. So I guess we'll give you one pat on the back for that. School students like Lucas Pelt came up front about witnessing the prank firsthand at the FIS Dance School in the Czech Republic on October 3rd. He said that during the dance, the instructor joked about Czech Republic's Minister of Health, Roman Ramula, who is pretty much equivalent of Dr. Fauci in the United States. I mean, we don't have that clip. It's just something that was said, but please do send it over or post it on the internet so we can add it to the story, or at least give you all context. That really is telling you what did happen. Aside from us lacking that clip, after briefly dancing back to back, the instructor moved to the group and back to traditional dancing positions. The school's Facebook page also confirmed the events by publishing photos taken during and after the prank. And obviously we wanna let you know of how everybody's reacting to this video because it's been shared so many times, it's not COVID safe. So here's, here's a little bit of both sides for you to give your own judgment reaction to this. This angry user tweets, this is insanity, sad, and a demonstration of how up this new normal is. A reply from the opposite side says, this is just bizarre, but speaking personally and professionally as a healthcare worker, I can promise you that COVID is most definitely not a scam. A pessimist tweet reads, I have said it before and it still applies. We are being punked as a species and is on every single person who accepts this But perhaps the most interesting comments come from Magnum. Quote, when the historians write this period, it will be a subject of incredible amazement and scorn. Now in the end, I just want to tell you because this is something that you need to know and we will repeat over and over again is COVID, it's not a scam. It's here, it's here to really wreak havoc and it's been wreaking havoc on many lives across the entire globe. So make sure you're social distancing. We obviously give you information for every video that we do with COVID-19 involved, spread anywhere from six feet apart or more, wear a mask, do the right thing and stay at home when possible. But on the comments down below, let us know what you think and let us know what you think in the best educated format possible. Also subscribe if you haven't, but come back for more social media news daily. It's Andy, I'm exhausted and tired, but we'll see you very soon, hopefully safe from COVID-19.